Assalamu alaikum. Today, April 14, 2021. In this video, we will see how to fix the problem of external storage request or permission in Admob. This problem must be fixed from May 5th. So, if you had received this message from Admob, see this video. Firstly, we have to understand the cause of the problem. So, if you have an application in Google Play which requires storage access and you had not declared an ask for permission before your app activity starts your app will be deleted from google play i'll give you an example in this application as you see we have storage as a permission required but if you open our application we have not the request i will show you here we open the application as you see there are not a request or a ask of permission so this is the problem that's why admob gives three solution the first is to update your application to follow best practices that are more respectful of confidentiality for example thanks to the storage access framework or media storage api the second is to update your app to declare permission to access all files it's to manage external storage in manifest file and to complete the permission to access all file statement in play console from May 5th. The th third solution is to remove permission to access all files in your app. So, for example, my application, I has, I had created my application in Codular. So I will choose the second solution. I will update my application and I will add or declare permission to access all files. I will show you how to do that. This is my Codular project. Firstly, we have to add a dummy component. It, uh, it's a non-visible component, which is file. We will add a non-visible component, which is file. Then we go to blocks. So here in when screen one initialize, we click here in screen one and we add call screen one ask for permission. add this in initialize block we add a text on the read dot permission dot write external storage Then we go to control or screen one. And we choose if permission denied. So if permission denied we have to close the app so we go to control and close application
so after the ask of permission if the user accept the activity will start if the user deny the application is closed so we save our project designer here in screen one We have to change the version code for me the last code was six and this is the seventh we export our apk And you will see the, the difference so we will show the ask of permission and we give the user the choice the permission now let's try This is the request of permission. So, if the user deny, application will close. And if the user allow, he will continue to use the application. That's it. So, the second step is to update the app in Google Play from May 5th and the most important is to complete the permission to access all file and to declare this in Google Play there are a statement in play console that we have to complete from May 5th that's all if your project is not created in Codular for example Android Studio you have to add this block in manifest file so you can search in Google and you have to add the manifest file android.permission.write external storage in your manifest file this is the only solution or you have to remove all permission or you have to use other types of storage but in Codular, we have not, we cannot, stat, we cannot uh, remove permissions. Though, so that's why we have, are, we have to declare our our permission and to update our application. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.